This is a review of the Ghost Tech phone case. This is from their Covert series, and the color is Stormy Smoke. It comes in a bunch of different colors, and they're translucent on the back. Ghost Tech's headquarters is in an old army terminal in Brooklyn, New York. This material looks like a hard plastic, but it's not. It's more rubberized, which is a good thing. If your phone drops, you don't want the shock to go straight through the case and right onto your phone. You want the phone case to absorb that shock. In the past, I've always used Spiegel's cases. They're made out of Germany, and they've always fit the phone perfectly. Spiegel is derived from two German words. Spieg, which symbolizes the ever-changing nature of technology, and Gin, symbolizing the solution for a perfect fit. Also, their cases are rubberized, so it absorbs the impact. Also, one of the good things is on the side, the lip comes up to protect the front of the phone. Now, the reason I had to go with Ghost this time, I looked at all the Spigen cases, but none of the cases for the Pixel 6 Pro had a lip that covered the front of the phone. The Pixel 6, just like some of the phones, you can see it's rounded on the edge. So what Spigen did on all their cases is they made the lip of the phone come down. I guess they were afraid that your finger might not be able to touch the edge of the screen. But the problem with that is when you set your phone down, there's no lip to protect it. So if it fell, it would crack right on the screen. And there's a lot of customer reviews on the speaking cases that they dropped their phone with the case on and it cracked the screen. The Ghost Tech is the only case I could find that the lip comes up to protect the screen. Let's take a look at this. If you can see right there with the box on, you can see if it hits the ground, it's gonna hit the lip first and give it some protection. And when you lay your phone down, it's going to hit that little lip instead of hitting the glass of your phone. This is what the Ghost Tech looks like from the back. You can see through the phone and you can see the Google emblem on this one. It's actually pretty cool. The cutouts are all perfectly done. They're precise. You can see on here, everything lines up. The case fits snug and precise on the phone, just like Spigen. It's got a good feel. It's got a good grip. So you don't feel like you're gonna, it's, the phone's just gonna slide out of your hand. It's kind of like, a, I was saying before, it's like a rubbery feel. Now, if you look at this right here, even the rubber comes out a little bit. So if you were to drop it, which a lot of times they'll land like this, they're gonna land something like this, but you can hear that. Yeah, I think they did a great job on this phone case. And if you're looking for an alternative to Spigen, definitely check out the Ghost Tech. Here's what it looks like going on. It's easy to take off and put on. Just put it inside there and you can see how easy it goes on. Once it's on there, it's not coming off. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. I'll be more than glad to answer them.